This is TFNN, the Tiger Financial News Network. TFNN, headline news update. Good afternoon, everybody. I'm Tommy O'Brien coming to you live from TFNN Monday afternoon as we come in two hours left in the trading day. And right now you get S&Ps negative by about three points. We were just in the positive in the last hour. You make it to a high 4064. That's about 15 minutes ago. Right now we've given it up a bit barely in the red. You get the NASDAQ 100 negative by 52 points approaching the highs that we had early this morning. Still negative by about four tenths percent. We get the Dow right now negative by 40 points. 32,219. Uh, not too much of a pop when you consider the pullback we had Friday, but you could be happy if you're a bull just with the markets settling even flat today after the destruction that took place on Friday. We got action all over the place, man. Crude, you talk about a move, $97.11. We were at almost $93, folks, as recently as almost 7, 8 a.m. this morning, let alone you back things up on a 15-minute basis to last week. You spiked to $86 last Monday. We're at $97 this Monday. Quite the move. We jump over to gold. There's some volatility for you as well. Like I said, we got huge moves in notes, bonds, the dollar index, gold contract right now up by a dollar. We were as low as 17.31 in the morning action. You jump over to the DXY. There's some volatility for you. Pre-market, 109.47. Right now, we're at 108.69 in the dollar. And we jump to the VIX right now. Volatility index backing off a bit. Still right where we closed our Friday's action, 25.73 for the VIX. And we jump over to notes and bonds, the 10-year. Negative by 17 ticks, that's looking at a yield of 3.11%. I talked about on my program this morning, the two-year at a record that we haven't seen since 2007, I think it said, of almost 3.5%, the yield on the two-year. We got higher rates, folks, lower price on the 10-year. We put this thing on a monthly. I was talking about this as well. Let's take a look at the 30-year. You put it on a monthly, really go back? I'm gonna see some dicey scenarios, man. We could be just coming back up, testing that line, line that we've been trending in for quite a period of time. You're talking about 20 plus years. We bounce, we trade lower, pretty decisive bar. Right now, you get the 30 year down a full point and four ticks at 136.01. Stay tuned, folks. We got a replay this hour. Our man Larry Pesavento's filling in for Tom live from three till four. We'll be right back, folks. The reality is that navigating financial markets can be risky. Markets can be chaotic and difficult to understand. Having the latest market advice